Several teachers walk out of their classrooms today at High Tech Middle School in Point Loma. Good evening. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. News 8 has learned there has been a battle brewing between teachers and administration about pay, late paychecks and other issues. Right now, the school board is in a special board meeting to discuss a separate issue, but is expected to hear an earful. News 8's Abby Alford explains what unfolded this morning and the confusion among parents and students. Teachers at High Tech Middle School at the Point Loma campus walked out of the classroom this morning. We're told they are fed up and they want the administration to do better. When High Tech Middle School students arrived for class this morning. At the beginning of school before we went into class, a lot of the kids were waiting outside and I saw a bunch of the teachers walk out of the school. We're told several of the 18 teachers and educational specialists walked. I didn't know what happened until later on when the principal explained it to us that the teachers were having a strike and walking out. Another eighth grader whose parent allowed him to text us said that teachers came in from other campuses asking them to write letters to the teachers who walked, thanking them for their work. Muska Wahab texted her dad. I just said the teachers left and I didn't really know what was going on. I was confused. Parents were also confused. I was a little bit disturbed. I, th I thought that seemed a bit irresponsible. Parents were allowed to pick up their kids early. I did come by the school at that point and I, I asked some of the administrators what was going on and they said that there were enough adults on staff to, um, to supervise the children today and that they'd give us further information as time went on and that it had something to do with some grievance the teachers had. No teacher would comment, but here's what we've gathered. High Tech High teachers recently created a union called the High Tech High Education Collective. A parent forwarded News 8 an email they received from two teachers who are resigning. They wrote, we have pleaded with central leadership at the organization to give us more support and resources, but the organization failed to respond to our pleas. And without that, we can't meet the needs of students and support them. I would like some answers. But a spokesperson sent News 8 this statement, in part calling it an unlawful work stoppage. While it is unfortunate and inappropriate that teachers left their students unattended, we have reached out to the High Tech Education Collective and are hopeful that they will help us resolve the issue and make sure that this does not happen again. I'm hoping they resolve this. It's unclear when the teachers will return to the classroom. In Point Loma, I'm Abby Alford for News 8.